All right, we have our posted Cossack internal external hip rotation stretch. Find something you can post up right uh, against here. I have uh, just the post of a rack right here. So just find something that you can put a little force into. We're gonna go with internal hip rotation right there. I'm driving that knee into the ground two to three seconds. Then I'll follow that up with some external hip rotation. So the goal here is once you kind of hit that end range of motion, try to really drive into the post, squeeze it, create some force there so we can capture a little bit more range of motion out of the joint that we're trying to get a stretch out of, in this case, the hip. So you can see with external rotation there, once I kind of hit that end range of motion, well, I squeeze I mean, the post yeah. a bit and try to really drive that knee down more to the ground. Stay in that footprint, kind of like what you can see from here. I'm going to try to kind of keep my foot in the same general area. Um, but with that being said, I don't want to clang that knee into uh, whatever post or support I'm posted against.